What's going on, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. Listen, man, I want to touch this topic one more again, one more again. This is about that voice recognition. I want you to talk. Want to talk to you about how come you cannot use uh, your voice recorder or voiceover in iMovie. You ready? Here we go. <laughs> All right, so check it out. I did two other videos on this, so if you haven't seen those, make sure you click. I guess I put a towel or maybe put a link down in the uh, you know comment section or maybe a towel up top. I don't know. We'll figure that out. But this is the last. This should be the last one. And so this video is really really simple. This is one reason why you may not be able to get your uh, voiceover to work in iMovie. So this is real simple. Watch this. All we got to do. Let me get this out of here. Get that out of there. This is real simple. All you do is you go to system preferences right down here at the bottom of the screen. You click on it. And what you're going to do is go over here to security and privacy. Click on that. And when you do, you'll see microphone Rottler. Click it. And you see you got choices to make. If it's unclicked in iMovie or Logic or Garage, whatever it is that you use, make certain that you click it and it will turn back on. Now, it's that simple. It's, it's that's it. That's the whole video. That's that's it. So listen, if you haven't, if this doesn't work, go check out the other two videos I got. Like I said, maybe I put a towel up or I leave a link in the description. But yeah, that's really it. So listen again. Once again, if you're enjoying these videos, be sure to go click like. Make sure you click subscribe. Ding the bell. Tell somebody about it. Share this. And uh, yeah, man. Let's, let's go ahead and make some movies, you heard? I will talk to y'all later in the next video. Peace.